turn on the computer. And that is what I get on my monitor. So that's what it looks like when you have a blown capacitor. As you can see, something just happened on the screen, so the computer is booting. So I know it's the video card. Okay, this is my GeForce 8600 GT. And I already unscrewed the fan, so I'm just going to remove that. And as you can see, this capacitor is blown, as well as this one and this one. I'm doing this on my iPhone, so it may not be terribly clear, but basically the tops blew open. You could compare that this one and this one. And you can see that it kind of blew up. So I went to a store and I got <coughs> the equivalent capacitors right here 1500 microfarad, 6.3 volts, and you can see the price is $1.79. So, what I have to do is desolder these three capacitors. So, if I flip this over, basically, I'm, I'm going to hold the soldering iron on these pins that stick out and pull from the other side until they come off. And then, I will put the new ones in, matching the polarities. Okay? Okay, you see these wires sticking out? That's because I replaced this cracked one. This cracked capacitor with a new one. Master polarities. And now I just gotta solder them. And unfortunately I can't hold the phone and solder at the same time, but... Okay. So I replaced this cap, this cap, and then this cap. This one I had to slant because the, the fan, this fan right here, was actually being obstructed from installation, so I had to slant that one. So now I'm just going to clean up the thermal paste, apply some new thermal paste, and I have installed the fan. I had to move some of these fins out of the way because these new capacitors are a little larger. And the one over here... I bent it forward. So now there's nothing to do but to test the card. Okay, the video card is in. And as you can see, this capacitor is laying down. But the wires are not touching, so I don't expect any problems. Okay, and now the moment of truth. I just powered on the computer. And I'm feeling confident, so let's see. There we go. The monitor is fixed. Well, not the monitor. The video card is fixed. And yes, my computer is overclocked. That's okay. There you go. That's how you fix a video card.